Hello comrades and welcome back. We are now at episode 17. Our economy is stabilized and we are plowing on forward. So let's join me. Okay. So we are here building up the secret police busily. Yeah, missing bricks. 125 tons. Um, financially, we are stable again. 6,000 ruble, not super duper much, but uh, our our industry is running on high gears. Let's let them run. Um, we have collected some of the crops, not all of them. This is why we replace our tractors. Um, so we have here 170 tons. Uh, and the other ones also around this one. Uh, here we have 250 tons. Uh, is there a comrade assigned to him? I don't think so. So, yeah. Don't forget to switch it, Dennis. And um, we also have here a reserve of 300 tons. So we have around about, let's say, 600-700 tons in the bank uh, crops. This one burns up to 20 tons of crops a day, which is enormous amount. Um, we are currently at 50%, around 50%, so let's say we burn 10 tons of crops a day, uh, which comes to 300 tons a month? No. Yeah, 300 tons a month. So we can uh, live with this three, four months and then crops are over, so we have to keep this one in mind not to get some money problems. Later season, we are building up the second uh, farm because of this situation. Let's assign a road crew here. Um, I don't think we can make it, but let's make something to help us here. So we assign. Uh, let's make a street connection here. And uh, let's start with the construction of the farm. The farm of the farm. <laughs> um, yeah. Yes. And uh, high priority. Mm. Can we assign the road crew to some other parts here? Who does do that? Um, if we have split this one off, we can connect this one back and also give them the next thing to do. This also. But uh, this one on a lower priority. So first do these two. So we can get to these two. No, uh, maybe we can. Oh, this one. Okay, this one is... This one shall also be... I think they can do two at once. Medium priority, please. Okay. Great. Um, so we are plowing on to the winter. We have... Uh, how many months? We have uh, three months to build a farm. I'm fairly positive that we manage it. Um, after the secret police is finished, I want to fire up the... Um, the university again. It was suspended uh, because of the critical situation of our nation. Um, yeah, we have some money in so we can start to construct our last remaining buildings. Um, do we... Yeah, let's let's uh, construct first the secret police and after that the buildings. So I pulled in uh, workers here and uh, the bricks are on the way. Let's hope everyone is involved in this project. Let's check if still everyone is everyone. Um, sadly, this one toggles. You are in there. You are also in there, yeah. Okay. So we can go on double speed because I think everything is stable and good. We have good water for this uh, little bugger here. 
Mm. One thing which really uh, nearly ended the run. Yes, Lenin. Totally right. He should be banished to Siberia. Yes. What? All factory? Yes, all factory. Maybe we should. No. This time not. No. They make good money for us, comrade. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Um, after the small talk with the statue, we uh, can look at some stats. So, uh, happiness is oh, at all time high, 88%. This is the optimal happiness I can reach on the hardest settings. Um, with, with the tools we have here. So, uh, with other tools, uh, it's also a very high happiness thing. Uh, if you're if you have a bigger uh, po bigger republic, you tend to have bigger problems, so the happiness will go down. Because, for example, you uh, build different housing, uh, which has an influence of the happiness. I go only with the best and uh, boxiest available options, which we can afford for our people to stick them in. Yep. Okay. Uh, by best I mean housing quality of 91%. What are your problems? Shut up. Uh, they're a little bit cold. A problem we know but uh, we don't deal with. Is the uh, drinking water supply? Yeah. Because I uh, didn't remember if I have something done to the water treatment plant if we ran out of money. The convicts are also maybe happy, maybe not. Mostly happy, I think. Uh, we can do nothing great for them. You look at the numbers here. <laughs> they get more sporty? Yeah. Who needs that? I don't need that. And you should. Get, get it to zero, maybe? No? Yes? No? Plus or minus something or other? So we can uh, propagate him to the max, but uh, yeah, he loses out here, so um, if he has five months here, he will lose around 10% of loyalty, which is quite bad, so I want him ASAP out of the prison. Um, oh, we know the loyalty here, okay. A secret police prison. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So he is quite happy. For whatever reason. He is not very uh, criminalistic. And he should move out of the prison as fast as possible. Um, productivity 93%. Yeah. Okay. See, she has. He? He or she? She has. She's. Looks like a he. Uh, yeah. Okay. Comrade, get out. Maybe they see the stars surrounding them having nice monuments, so... Their loyalty, yeah. You see it's going down and down and down. It's not good. So even if they are uh, very happy prisoners... Uh, it, it, it suffers because of the uh, loyalty loss. But 30% uh, left loyalty is really not so bad. Um, fighting with the loyalty because uh, no radio and um, we can already look for the passive loyalty so the way to go is planting trees and uh, Soviet stars in our city so the people see the greatness mm. in essence every housing block gets this Lenin and uh, one of these small things here they are quite cheap but not so effective uh, if you place them strategically, you uh, reach most of the houses. So I have placed them to reach most of the houses. Um, here's the next one. This one isn't reached. I don't know if I have something built here. Oh, yeah. This one. Yeah, nice. Okay. Um, and the two stars which uh, shine the brightest of our country will... Uh, really big reach and uh, over 5% loyalty gain. Yeah. When 
What's the perfect ratio? I don't know. Uh, for me, this one works out. Uh, I also think there was uh, influence because we also loyaled up our situation here at the working places so the people don't forget. So if they are stumble run against the statue at the hometown, they also need to run against this Lenin here to uh, keep their loyalty in check. Yeah. Destruction is um, quite happy jumping around. I think they have everything they should have. Um, the fabric count is good, so we have uh, we are not at zero fabric, which is very nice. Um, the chemical, don't know, should be some electronics here. Um, yeah. The clothes are also at some plus, which I like. Uh, I have one truck exporting the clothes. Here are the chemicals here. Uh, so the truck, the, <laughs> the uh, cornerstone of our uh, whole operation is one truck running to the border and back. Um, and he, not he, these are the grain trucks. Yeah, yeah he is. Um, he exports the uh, our clothes. And also imports, uh, exports, and uh, so he unloads here at the border. I think he should load. Let's stop it for a second. Custom source here. He also should load uh, chemicals because we configured him this way. And here he loads, yeah, and he unloads, yes, yes. Um, so do this comrade let's see if he is configured for this job because uh, if he runs to the border he can also take some chemicals which would be very polite of him um, so he has uh, yeah 100% of clothes and yes so he takes 10 or 20 15% maybe of chemicals uh, we calculated the ratios so I calculated them first time a little bit wrong. Uh, the second time, this is a solid ratio, I think. The nice thing is now he exported, he makes money, and uh, at the same time he takes some money. So our bank uh, balance is quite relaxed. Um, what we can do, because we are very stable on the bank, let's buy ourselves some new tractors. Ah, the bug. The bug should be fixed, but I don't trust it. So, hmm. Let's get ourselves some nice tractors. Um, tract uh, sewing, sewing, sewage, snowblower, sewing. Okay, we started with these little contraptions. No good. Very slow, uh, very slow on their heels, um, and very slow at plow plowing, uh, plowing, sewing. Uh, these ones a little bit faster, and I think we need it. Let's hope uh, we manage to uh, this time plow all the fields and get everything in. If not, we need uh, bigger covered holes. Uh, we play without mods, so these are no no. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes. So, yeah, here we go. Proud of our nation. Cornerstone of second cornerstone of our economy um, comrades we need crops mm. you can go you can go you can go and you can go okay want to see maximum utilities here make the nation proud okay they are moving along I have sent everyone in um, so the I think the let's fly to the secret police um, this is a little bit stalled because of that but here okay I think they should finish this one first mm. 
Because here are the cranes, and the cranes are needed also at the, uh, at the farm. So hopefully uh, our comrades get to work and deliver the needed bricks. You are not busy. Oh, you unusual sight. So we want you busy. Lord group. Yes. Yes. We can do nothing. Yes, something. Yes, the excavator on the wrong <laughs> part of business. Okay. I really wanted to have this one finished. This one also waits. Okay. So nothing, nothing we can do here. Speed up our operations. Also waiting for bricks and boards. <laughs> Money side after the track door shock uh, will recover. Uh, the dollar side suffered also quite hard because of our pumping situation. Um, let me take a little sip of coffee. So the uh, the dollars also plunged down um, after our farming situation, where we ran into the trouble of um, the pump was here. And the pump started with a promise to deliver for our great nation um, water with the water quality of uh, 86%. And uh, this factory needs 85%. So we thought this was a perfect match and they would work together like a charm. And then this pump decided because uh, he saw some trees growing there and there and trees are bad for the water, as you know. Um, that the water quality went down, it went down 85% and uh, also 84%. So <laughs> we got here, this one didn't want to work with the water well anymore. So he decided to stop and because he stopped, uh, our sweatshop sweatshirt operation stopped and uh, no sweatshirts for the commune uh, means no money for the commune. So um, yeah. <laughs> Go back, look at the uh, episodes, they're quite uh, interesting. And so we had to build this one. And um, he has a uh, fantastic water quality, so 94%, uh, uh, which is max quality, which we can achieve. Um, yeah. Um, so I don't think the, uh, that the pollution is hurting very much, but if you look at this one, for example, we have here. Um, very low 79 so pollution has an influence but uh, the biggest one is are there things on the ground uh, uh, build it, buildings or something uh, they are hurting the water quality the most if you don't have buildings in the vicinity you are good to go and always keep your water clean if you uh, produce drinking water because the uh, water treatment plant will thank you for it if you uh, hear deal with dirty water this bar goes up so it's the uh, treatment percentage not the water output percentage the more the dirty water is the more the bar goes up and uh, the more chemicals you use and the less you can produce in total the production is not completely related to the bar so but we are at the minimal production you can see it's uh, at the moment it's more or less correlating but not completely yeah ob this is clear, it's a little bit misleading in my mind. Um, so, for example, if I have here, uh, we have now um, a water quality which comes in at uh, 94%. If we have a water quality of 80%, this bar at the same production would be here. And the chemical con consumption would be here. And at uh, maybe half load, the bar could go up to and you can only get half of the productivity, uh, half of the output of your chemical plant. If you try to treat dirty water, yeah, it's a little bit not the best concepts to understand. But uh, if 
it can make sense if you uh, yeah if you think about it but they could make it a little bit easier to understand or uh, write a text at least that uh, this is um, it's not the current production percentage it's the water treatment percentage or water capacity p treatment percentage yeah because I have seen uh, water treatment plants, uh, big water treatment plants running at full production, only having half of the red bar full, because the water which comes in was clean. So he was fine. Okay, Koki, so we have also four tractors, which their new home is here. We have fields and we have this one okay bulldozer here as he should be we have finished this one so we can go on oh so is it completely finished no it isn't so where uh it is it isn't it was maybe it was separated so uh, uh. Ah, assignment mode. <laughs> okay. Nice. <laughs> Only one time show me a playthrough of a competent person, please. Okay. Let's um. Let's build some trees. You plant them, I think. You don't build them. Could we plant bushes? or Maybe because this is a special field in the center. We go for that. You are in the bush department, and uh, you are in the beach, 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 bigger trees, which look more impressive department. Mm. Yeah, these uh, surrounded surrounded those fields with some kind of greenery make them look, uh, let's say, realistic, uh, but. At least more visually appealing, and uh, you see them. So you see these hedges of trees or beaches or whatever um, quite regularly in the wild. So beached up. This one is free. Maybe she he remains free, free as God made him. Um, Yes, yes, yes. So, hopefully, no woodcutter comes along and starts to work on our little nice hedges. Okay. We're waiting for the secret police. 60 tons. And busy vehicles. We are at 86% happiness, 2% down. I think it's because of the heating situation. Some This block is not uh, heated at the max. We are at, uh, uh, at the maximum of our heating range. So this one is 700 meters from here. And he goes a good while to here. So it's uh, at the max. See here, the boiler temperature is not at the uh, highest levels. Also, if you look at this one, for example, a little bit higher, and this makes a really makes a difference. Mm. We can contemplate building a second heating thing here with a underground heating pipe because the underground heating pipes are better isolating. 
Um, so everyone gets to have it warm and cozy. Usually if you start to uh, fiddle around with the heating and uh, never build pipes which are longer than 1000 meters underground, uh, if you need pumps and something you will never get it warm. Um, so either you have 1000 meters or you build another heating plant in essence. Um, everything else will lead to non-optimal outcomes which we don't like. So we don't do. Yeah. Okay, we are back at 50k on the ruble side. Nice, nice. Let's fly over to our construction here. So we are in the last stage. We only need uh, steel and mechanic mechanicals. <laughs> yeah, why not? Mechanical components. Uh, Let's put it a little bit farther down on the priority list. Because we construct a secret police and after that uh, he gets the cranes. Road crew can go to work. Thank you. Oh. Also subject to be worked on. Little buggers also uh, give them some people. Nice to see your industrial sector plowing. You know. I'm perfectly happy with this output we have at the moment. Uh, it's great. So let's see our finances. Last month we have a really funny economy. Um, Export 66,000 rubles. Um, we have to import uh, the chemicals, which are 10,000 rubles. So we have uh, over 50,000 rubles of plus. Uh, we also need to feed our people. So we have, let's say, 5,000 rubles to feed them. Uh, we need some alcohol, 2,000 rubles, 16,000 rubles. We need. Uh, we don't need clothes because we produce them ourselves. Uh, we need uh, fuel. So let's say we have. Uh, we also need uh, power, um, which we get from the Westerners. So it's three thousand dollars. So let's say altogether, we uh, we pay twenty thousand ruble and we make sixty thousand, uh, which is a net profit of over forty thousand rubles a month. That's great. Uh, nearly a million a year. Yep. Can work with that. And everything uh, done without any resources off the ground, any uh, oil, any crazy ideas of uh, having some funny industries. It's uh, a very solid grounded industry. Let's hope we get the second farm up, but I'm convinced we do. Mm. If the secret police is uh, done, uh, he gets some cranes and he will be uh, online in no time. Oh. Let's get some people in here. Okay. So with nearly one million of profit under our belly, uh, we can extend the profits if we build a chemical plant. So like you have seen, the chemicals are 10,000 rubles a month, which we can also uh, compress to produce our own chemicals. Mm. One chemical plant is enough for our operation here. So we will uh, make additional 120,000 rubles a year and we will be a net profit of 1 million rubles a year. With uh, this, uh, in essence, let's turn this off. In essence, this industry sector and uh, the town which we built in, uh, let's see, we constructed it in yeah four years, a little bit less. Uh, yeah, we are in the fourth year. We are uh, playing for uh, yeah nearly four years now. 
let's repeat for years. Um, so if these crates are free, they will go to the farm, and if they went to the farm and back, I will build some housing because I think we are running quite high on the housing population. That's yeah, we have, let's say, it's 200 free places for workers. But workers we need, and workers we always need. We have uh, 1,600 people. Let's check them out. 68 percent, 2 percent less happy. But yeah, oh, we have. We need a freaking farm online, comrades. Get rid of the, this one. Also, we can send. Uh, let's stop it for a moment. Uh, we can send our tractors to to the new home. So new home they should get. Temporary home. Yes. Okay. Let's fly to the border. Get out of here. Um, we have four tractors waiting. You stole my vehicles. Hmm. I hope uh, he learned something. Uh, yeah. Get some respect, comrade. Where are we? Flown the wrong way. So we have everything here, high priority. Let's get ready for the sowing season. Do we have the power? The power of power. No, we don't. So this is no good. I interrupted the power lines several times, so I don't know if they are complete. Are you? Maybe? Talk to me? Looks good on this side. Yeah. Basically, ah, they need some workers and they are up and running. Make it on the highest priority. They don't have much to do, but yeah. Always the little things you forget. Okay. What's happening here? Twenty-five tons. So we should have three flatbeds to do the job. You're relaxed. Yeah, your source of this and this is empty. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So let's delete everything before we started again. Just to be sure to make no stupid mistakes. Looks like this one. Get here. Thank you. And you also, you are relaxing because you you claim to have nothing to do. It's no good. They are, we are pulling out of the open storage, which we see here behind us. You can also start to refill it. Um, because we have good income and there's no problem. In stocking the open storage here for our convenience it's here 
should be much faster loading and downloading times than the border class we have uh, connected. Yep, uh, we have connected a loading station. Also will help with the job. Oh, come on! This one, this farm is built by hand, by the hard work, hand work of our loyal, trusted worker community. Which is a shame. A little bit of mismanagement here and there. Um, okay. Yeah, I gravel up. So, how we are sewing? Let's see. I say it's too late for. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Little buggers are running around. Push it. Okay. Maybe push it not so hard, push the other one. But this one also can be pushed. Push the other one, but push it also. Yeah. God damn it. Ten tons. Because these comrades are relaxing and uh, having a good time under the trees there, it's uh, some inconveniences in our little town. Which start to take a little bit shape. I think it's a little bit more coherent look than a bunch of things clumped together. But it's also quite boxy and samey. Um, I usually don't go with so much of the same and so hard. Uh, yeah. Try to be a little bit more innovative than making a box of people. But this one, it is a box because uh, we went for maximum efficiency and uh, it's all built around this water supply which is the limiting factor and um, yeah one water pump pumping for uh, here and there yeah and one water pump uh, coming in i usually plump in two of these things so i have over 100 cubic meters coming in here and have some reserves but it's simply not used this town is made for 3,000 people and uh, this is the limit. It's limited mostly by the shopping center which you see is at 60% and a quite not so comforting rate because if the happiness of our people go down, yeah, we run into problems. The productivity goes down and uh, now we have a productivity of 90% which is great. But it can also be 50% and if you have productivity of 50% you cut this in half you don't uh, serve all our people and if they are not served they get more unhappy because they don't get their uh, things like for example this one here which takes home uh, 2.6 kilos of food which is a great feat of food yeah and he wanders on enjoying some culture and now he's done he spends his free time free maybe yeah, he does nothing because he has no electronics. He can sit down and watch uh, Comrade Lennon here in all its glory from his balcony, for example, and hopefully get more loyal to us. Mm. Okay. Uh, missing, 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 missing. So let's give them the funniest vehicles we can find. Um, Trabant, yes. Oh, this one looks very. Or this turbant? Or this one? No, we can No, this is this is absolutely. It's called uh, Rennpappel in Germany, which is racing, uh, racing cartonage. <laughs> because these <laughs> these little things are made out of uh, not so sturdy material. Yeah. Where are you? They look like a U-boat, actually. No, they are on the road. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 
a very fuel economic two stroke uh, engine. Uh, they are sound. It sounds like they sounded uh, like your typical lawnmower. So, plow along, comrade. Okay. We are here done. Let's activate our force and hope they get to work at least to the first field. Because I also see here some losses of crops coming on. You have no energy. Yeah. Let's hope they get started at least. Because if they have no energy, no fuel gets delivered here. If they have no fuel, they will go somewhere else to refuel maybe. Or even don't start to work. Let's see how he does in crisis mode. Okay. We don't want you to auto search for nothing. <laughs> auto search also didn't find anything, so it's great. So let's see. One, two, three, four. Yes. Go to work. You also. Yes, I got to work to the first feet at least. Um, so get me some people. Yeah, nice. Funny minibuses are arriving. Okay. Um, I want you. So everyone get to work here, literally. Have some people to help out. Um, okay, these are done. That's nice. This one isn't and will not be. The central field. Do we wait for the central field? I don't know. Let's try it at least. This one should be the lowest priority, so our people don't get any funny ideas. Yeah, they are plowing along way faster than we can with our roads. But if they have no energy, they will not. They cannot refuel, and I think they can. How how much are we behind? Yeah, they are at the second field batch, so it's maybe 70% yield this year from this farm, or something like this. Not optimal. Next batch of fields will be this one. So you can go here, here, and here. And after that I want the central field. Money is looking okay. We have no energy? Oh dear me. High priority. This one is assigned to maybe not all of them. <laughs> they must run around in the construction offices like chickens. High priority this, high priority this, comrade made up your mind. So uh, this one will not be built. 
this season. Here we go here. Let's hope the comrade tractors have refueled uh, in their spare time. How much fuel do you have? Oh, nice. Yes, he refueled. Yeah, he gets a medal. So this is what I mean. So he started here. And they all started here. And now he went from this field to this field and starts to plow along. So the, um, actually how you assign them. In the next season I will assign them maybe this one. And after this, this one. And after this, this batch. Um, because they run from here to there. Which is not so super optimal. But it's also not the end of the world. Especially if we are late in the game here. But the good thing is the tractors are refueled, so they can get on with the work and uh, are not suffering the... I'm sorry for the scrolling. Uh, not suffering for the um, lack of electricity here. Yeah. But I do want to have it running in a normal fashion, like a human being. Hmm. What is going on with our roads here? Nice. This one is done. This one gets done. Do we, have, do we have? Yes, we have two additional fields. Oh, with the help of the people, it will be ready. Lickety spit. 15, 50 people max. Yeah, I have the bulldozer. So we are. Uh, yeah, this one is the. Yeah, maybe we can get a nearly complete harvest. Does not look so tragic for me, to me. Got move the smaller fields a little bit. But to which end? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um our secret police. Let's see. So, they are staffed and happily running around. I don't think we need so many of them here. So, we cannot say... Yeah. Consistency, comrades, consistency. I cannot click here to adjust them. So, now we know how loyal our people are. How loyal are you? 37%? What do we really care? I think everyone is 37%. Yeah, it's uh, socialism, everyone is the same. Only maybe the intellectuals in this home here, which are uh, ancestors of our import. Yeah, they have a glorious 38%. <laughs> yeah, so we are a rock bottoming out. But what we can do is now. Uh, we can say, okay, everyone. Who has uh, on the snowflake level? Only for, we want only the students with forty percent. I doubt we get some, but let's take a look. And we can again activate our efforts to educate them. Mm -hmm. And I want to have at least maybe let's see, thirty-five percent, thirty percent of edu of teachers. So we have, oh, we have one, yeah, snowflake, yeah, 37%, what you're talking about, you're not, yeah, <laughs> so, okay, so let's go 35%, um, this is how I control how many people get educated, uh, so I raise the bar uh, for the most loyal students, these are the most valuable also for my country, wow, do we have many people here, um, which are also the most... Let's hope nothing else blows up here in our faces because everyone starts to go to the university. Uh, yeah. Because we didn't... Uh, we didn't educate them for some time. We have to deal with a little avalanche of uh, people we need to educate. But they also look nice. Biggest problem is you have here, like this one... Uh, maybe not hitting him. You have a twenty-year one, a twenty-year-old one uh, blocking a blocking a chair in the listening room, and 
after that he will drop out at 21 and is half educated maybe because he thinks he's such a smart guy dropping out of the university uh, goes to the shop and buys the radio listens to the radio uh, and only costing us money in essence so uh, half educating people is the worst thing you can do uh, so limit it uh, maybe limit it by walking distance or limit it by raising the bar higher and higher which also is great you don't educate the people who are a bit on the lower side of the loyalty which are also not so valuable for you the higher the loyalty is the higher is the productivity okay let's hope everything is selected here it's marked in green but it's green on green so whatever no um we are out of crops something yes we are out of crops okay mm, we have some emergency crops but not much so we need to reorganize our systems here so essentially he is a cornerstone of our you um, you load here let's click this so he gets the unloading in the middle load you go here and you load this one. It's crops and wait. And go. And you copy the situation of your friend. Okay. What? This is not copying the situation of your friend, comrade. But whatever. Feel free. So we can restart our uh, money income, but yeah, uh, let's let's <laughs> let's stabilize the whole situation because I don't want to run into the same problem we ran before that we have a deadlock, essentially. Um, I want to have cover tolls. <laughs> So, do we have bigger ones? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, this are the smallest. Mod, 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 mod. Skoda. One, two. Okay. So, these are still the hot things. So, we load. This is the security thing for uh, chemicals. Um, and we unload, yeah, these two things. So these guys will help to stabilize our economy in times of need. So that the uh, ruble will roll, keep the ruble rolling. Um, that's what they say at least, I think. What they say? Yep. So we have to uh, wait for April, May, June, July. And of, uh, last time the, at the beginning of the July, those little buggers were ready. Uh, the big ones are still on sewing. So what I mean by, let's demonstrate this one. Um, after they are finished completely plowing the field, it starts to grow. So this one is already here. Um, and if you start with a big one, you need more time to plow it. So the growing season starts later. This is the beauty of the medium field uh, strategy. Yeah. First plowed, first growing, and uh, early early cotton at the next season to make them into sweatshirts into our sweatshirts uh, siblings hmm. we could maybe make some decorations here do we enhance our factory complex You can do it. After we have saved our economy a second time. <laughs> so give me a kind of inspiration. Do we go with mm, black or not black? Maybe orange is the new black. 
Let's see how this looks. A little bit stupid. We go for this one. We'll also go this way. Holding here, alt, uh, so we can find adjust the camera movement and find adjust the placement of the gravel, which is a royal pain if you don't know this combination. Which I also learned quite late. So this one we don't need. And I think if we delete this road, uh, some grass will return. Let's see. Okay. Because I never have seen this these ones uh, burn. Famous last word. Um, so let's see. <laughs> if he's missing in action, uh, we will know why. <laughs> what really kind of amuses me, and um, seems to be a guy who's easily amused, is the <laughs> collection of bulldozers we have. So. Uh, we need a glorious return, maybe, of kernel failure, because the whole... Oh, it's the collection gun. Oh, no collection here? Okay, there was before. So it's only the multi-purpose bulldozer. <laughs> because here, in this sub-menu, there were listed all the bulldozers, which from all sub-menus were a collection. Yeah, they get rid of it. Maybe it was also uh, not reasonable enough for that. <laughs> Okie dokie. Money... Dollars going down, Google not so much up in the air as I need and want them to. Mm. So, the same game as last year, <laughs> same procedure as every year, yes. Um, let them do their job, you also. And you. And. Let's hope we don't run into bankruptcy. Meanwhile, so these are around twenty thousand rubles a pop. I also want uh, some exports to the western border, but we have no free cover tolls uh, because, oh, comrades, uh, one of you can do something else for me. Please. Um, yeah, I want some combine harvesters from the western side. It's the be all and end all of it. Um, reason is they are faster, they are f the fastest ones, and um, I should make me some crops. I started with these ones reluctantly uh, because. Uh, we ran out of money <laughs> at the same time we needed to harvest something, so yeah, fantastic situation to go. Um, yes, 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 yes. So yes, let's look at this one. We are here down a lot of people, but this doesn't matter. Um, because the crop situation was a little bit uh, on the crappy side. Next one, I want to have this one plowed. So if we uh, have uh, some income problems, we can raise our income problems by creating more income problems. Get on it, high priority. Do you get a mechanization? Yes, you get one. Okay. So we stop our production for a small, small period of time. Um, Let's give this one some love. So the finishing touches. 
of <laughs> great arsenal of uh, three varieties variants of uh, painting the scorched earth. Yes. This one ain't no finished. Do me finish this one, please. Thank you. Okay. So it looks like one uh, combined factory of goodness. Oh. This one looks quite challenging, rather. <laughs> <sighs> How do we solve this the less intrusive way? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. So you go here. Go. Thank you. Mm. Do we start? We don't start. Why? High priority. Maybe they are busy with something else. For sure they are. Oi, dump us. Please give me a favor and uh, do this up for me or we get into financial problems. Ah, uh, thank you. Thank you very much. So how much... Uh, we need only one load. Can decrease the number of personnel here to... Um, 50%. Let's say 20 here. And we can research uh, chemicals if we have cleared the backlog of uneducated, so or less educated people. 19 years, this is what I'm talking about. 1.66. So let's hope he just doesn't drop out. Uh, but I think he will make it. Let's keep him under wraps. Hopefully, pin this. Don't know. No pinage here. Fields are plowed, so the race to get some combine harvest is on the way it begins now. Uh, we need 10,000 ruble per harvester, uh, $10,000. And um, yeah, we have just stopped our income, so <laughs> here we go. Let's see if we, uh, people do not make any sense. Uh, let's see if we send an excavator. There you go. Oh! A bulldozer. Yeah, our person got away. Ah. Uh, too sad. Okay. So in the in the situation of shooting ourselves in the foot, we are here now. We are here empty. Yes. Um, so one of our comrades trying to scrub out the last thing of grain here may go here. And after that, will help with the border crew. Are you this one? Yeah. Okay. You help here? No, here. Um. Ah, we are now open for business again. Okay. Comrades, why are there only three of you? Uh, maybe one is uh, was locked up in the <laughs> in the bus stop. 
uh, we should change the route so they don't return <laughs> to home base here. Okay. So this one here, uh, where are you? Close it. Oh, ooh. no, yes, no. Okay. Oh, he's on the way. Maybe you return and pick up some people, won't you? Uh, you return, but you don't. Okay. No. This does not look like your stop. Is it? Yeah, there are people waiting here, comrade. Oh, ooh, mm. I've seen something which is from the very start. So this one I really don't want. Um, it is assignment of people who are waiting there and uh, leaving this bus stop to go on other adventures. And let's help our comrade here out in his need times of need. Yes. See, you only need to see the. <laughs> yeah. You only need to see the. But it's realistic, I think. Uh, making a U-turn without such a road can be a little bit more interesting. What was this one for? Ah, this is... Ah, okay. It's a minibus people. Yeah. Okay. Do we have the... Is it... Yes, it is. Okay. So how much time do we have until... Com combine time? Um... Okay, so I think we can wrap it up here. I will get my combines, so at least two, so I hopefully don't start to harvesting. Yes, it's really a good price for them because they're so much faster. Um, speed limit of 32. There's all, uh, even one which is, I think, a class higher. Yeah, and um, I really uh, like the setup of this one farm uh, dealing with everything because it's easy, uh, you know. So if you have better tractors than we have, you could even have 12 big fields and one farm. And um, maybe I took my time to lay out these fields, but it's easy to lay out the fields the way that they are uh, quite near to each other and you save driving time. Maybe uh, we have suffered greatly from the last adventure where we have no driving time. How oh, do we have power? We have no power. Okay, why? This one. Make it work. Give it the beans. Please. Okay. Yeah. So, solve the last mystery of this series. Uh, looking for loyalty of 37%, having reactivated our technical university, struggling with the loss of crops. Yep. Yeah. Struggle it is. Um, also, I, I, because I wanted to make some dollars, I uh, used this one for the dollar export side the other one is for our side so uh, i really cut off my financials oh i'm very sorry i wanted to wrap up, wrap up. but maybe we uh, maybe we slow down this ones but mm. yes slow down we shall um, at least stop this one uh, because these are spending money we currently hardly have. Let's... Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, we needed to go, but we can't. Um, yeah, no. No silos for you at the moment, comrade. Even if I lose... Let's see. Yes, I will lose. Boards. Bricks, no steel here.
steal here. So this one is quite active. Let's see how you are doing. You are doing great. So uh, I will stop him. Only let build this one, but yeah, it's a little problem because of the yeah. We will solve it next time. <laughs> so come back and uh, join me next on our next adventure. Bye, comrade.